<laughs> hey you guys, welcome back to Nini's Eats. I'm your girl Nini. And today, first off, I want to say happy Cinco de Mayo. Woo you guys, it fell on a Taco Tuesday. And we're stuck in the house. Can you believe that? But that's okay though. That's okay though. That's why I'm here. You got you. I made some Barrera juicy pork tacos. I have the juice here. And I have some I have three elotes back here. I have some lime juice. I have my yellow peppers and oh and to drink. It wouldn't be a perfect meal without this. <laughs> you guys, I'm excited. This is my first time ever making this meal. Let me stop playing. Let me say my grace. Father God, I'd like to thank you and praise you for this meal. I signify you through your word and prayer, and I cast out anything happens to me in Christ Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. Okay, so like I said, this is my first time ever making this meal. I've seen it, uh, and it looks delicious, right? Like, come on, how are you going to tell me it doesn't? You want to see the inside? Ooh. Melted cheese, shredded pork, and what you're supposed to do, you guys, is you're supposed to do this. Well, first, I'm going to squeeze some lime in it. You guys see that steam coming out of there? Oh, fresh pot off the stove. I planned it that way. <laughs> Here we go, you guys. Oh. Oh, man. Look at that. First bite. Mm. Mm. No. Oh, it's, it's good. I'm gonna need my napkin for this one. On my towel. Y'all. Like I said, I've seen this all over. Especially like in food trucks. Y'all know I used to live in LA, right? But I've never tried it. guys excuse the noise of my fan it is summertime in Las Vegas Nevada I don't care what the calendar says it's hot and the food is hot and I'm hot so the fan is on okay <laughs> okay so I think I know why I've never tried it Look at that fried cheese. Oh, fried cheese. It is because traditional Barrera, I hope I'm pronouncing it correctly, is like cow tongue or goat meat or, you know, um, that's not really my cup of tea. But I've seen cheese ones. I've seen. Oh. I've seen uh, chicken ones. And I was like, pork, pork, pork. We'll suck up that. Oh. Mm. <laughs> I'm enjoying myself. Let's see if I can get a cheese ball. Where's the cheese? It's definitely in here. It's falling apart, but it's so good. Mm -hmm. This is my first time making that. The family said that it's a hit. My husband freaking started clapping, you guys. He started get, He gave me an applause. <laughs> he thought he only wanted... Um, Two came back for two more. I 
Have you guys ever had these or ever made them or your auntie or your grandma makes them? Or your neighbor. <laughs> so good, okay. Here's an elote. Oh, look at that beautiful elote. Mmm, can be good. I'm happy. This is it. These almost didn't make it here, y'all. Because I was cooking for everybody else. I like to try to, you know, as best as possible, feed everybody before it's my turn. That way they're full. The babies lay down and take a nap. You know what I'm saying? Everybody is comfortable enough to be quiet while I'm recording. So I'm watching their food and everybody's saying it's good. And of course, I'm tasting the meat as I cook it. And I'm like, forget those elotes. <laughs> I'm about to go in on these tacos. But I was like, it's not a mukbang. Fried cheese. Fried cheese. Oh, you hear that crunch? Ooh, <sighs> so much going on here. Mm. <laughs> so I was like, I'm just eat the tacos, like, that would be good enough. I got something to dip it in, you know, decorate it, make it real pretty, like, can y'all see it? If I'm pushed it any further back, we're going to be out of frame. Anywho, you know. But then I was like, no, I'm going to go to Because I actually went to the store, got the parquet butter, you know, of course I already have mayo and got the cheese. <coughs> Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, that sucker was spicy. Do you guys see that? Look at that. If you guys want to see how I made it, go follow your girl on Instagram and check out my Insta story. I made everything from scratch, you know, besides the tortillas. Of course, I didn't make the tortillas myself, but I fried everything. I did everything. Like everything. I even went to... my local gardenia store and got all the chilies excuse me if you haven't tried this you guys especially when you eat Mexican food you have got to try this juice it's not juice it's a it's a soda Excuse me. <laughs> Some people call it punch, juice, whatever. I actually did a poll. Was it yesterday when I went? Yeah, yesterday when I went grocery shopping. Um, what are your guys' favorite? Jaritos? Jaritos? A lot of you guys answered. Mango, strawberry. I haven't tried, tried strawberry yet, but I want to. I should have grabbed it while I was there. But lime is my all time favorite. Mm. The fried cheese. 
Mm. <laughs> what are you guys eating on? Comment down below, let me know. You guys, I had fun making this meal. I'm so excited about this, uh, you know, taco series that I'm doing. There's so many different styles of tacos out there. And of course, they all look yummy. All of them. So I can't wait till next Tuesday. <laughs> I'm enjoying this Tuesday, but I can't wait till next Tuesday. Excuse me. There's so many flavors going on. I bought the meat. And the and everything last night, right? But, so last night, I made the chili uh, marinade. Put the pork in it. Let it sit in the refrigerator till about three o'clock. I think I made it like around, shoot, I don't even know to be honest. I could look back at my Insta story, but I don't know. And uh, it chilled overnight in the refrigerator. At 3 o'clock, I woke up, put it in the oven, 500, 500 degrees, <laughs> because most people, here I go off to, put it in a, like a crock pot or a pressure cooker, I don't have either, yet, but so I just put it in the oven, 500 degrees, from 3 o'clock to like, shoot, 10 o'clock, y'all, when I say it just... It just mm, mm, fell apart. I didn't even have to. I didn't have, have no, no, no. I didn't even have to work for it. I could have said I could have said shred, and it would have just fell apart. <laughs> for real though. <laughs> I'm happy I did this. So good. while I'm recording this. You guys know I record from my phone, right? So, as I'm recording this right now, at this moment, I'm getting Instagram story replies. So, that means that you guys are just now starting to see the outcome of these. Do you get what I'm saying? Like, in real time. Do you get what I'm saying? <laughs> so, like, I just saw Will and Jay just reply to the story. My cousin Michelle just replied, replied to the story. Kaya just replied to the story. So you guys in real time are just now seeing what I did with these. You guys, this is fried cheese. Like, oh my God. You see why these one? You see why these one? There's another type of taco that I was interested in. And more than likely, you'll get that one next week. So stay tuned. I got another one. But I was watching Juan Tran. Y'all know who he is, right? He's like one of the one of the best chefs on YouTube, besides Views on the Road and uh, Lizzie Lou. I love both of those ladies too. Anywho, 
and I and this his video of him making these came on my recommendations because I was looking up different types of tacos on YouTube. And I was like, ooh, <laughs> ooh, what's that? Look at this. That's meat and cheese. <laughs> and anyways, y'all seen Quan Tramp cook before. So that one. <laughs> That was a juicy one. Mm. That's too good. Mm -hmm. Uh oh. Now she's about to start eating like she's not on camera. Mm. That was good. So good. But yeah, y'all, follow your girl on Instagram. Y'all already know that's where all the fun stuff happens. I do all kinds of posts. You know, everybody's involved together and stuff like that. And that, I think that's what makes you guys excited for the actual video. Because when I was at the store, I was showing you guys the peppers. I was like, can you guys, ooh, can you guys guess what I'm making? So people were guessing. And then when I started cooking and prepping and stuff like that, you guys were able to see that. And now, you're able to see the outcome. Oh, listen to this. Can you hear it? It is so... Yummy. Good. I'm like really proud of myself because I made something different. I really stepped like not out of my comfort zone. The kitchen is totally my comfort zone. But I made something I've never made before. And it turned out exactly how I figured it would taste. I would love to have someone who, you know, like, mama appetite, or, you know, have her make it and eat it. <clears throat> I've actually seen uh, Nate from Big Guy Appetite eat it before. I'm not sure if she cooked it or if he bought it. But. Yes, honey. And y'all, I feel real bad, but I'm full. I'm full as heck. I really am. I had five, so I had two and a half tacos. I'm stuffed, and I stuffed these tacos. It's not like there's no meat in them, you know what I'm saying? I stuffed them. You guys can have this one. You want to take this one to go? Look at that one. You can have this one to go too. So, oh, oh look at that! Oh, it's crispy, and crunchy. Oh, it's still hot. I wonder if I could get a cheese pull. Probably not. Dang it! <laughs> it's still hot though. It's still warm. These olives were bomb. Elotes was bomb. This was good. Okay, so. I believe it's called, mm, it starts with the C, com, Comisa, I, I don't know. Anyways, this is the chili sauce that I have blended up in the blender. 
and uh, let the meat marinate in, let the meat bake in it, cook in it, and then you take the meat out, you shred the meat, and then you keep warming this up and let it keep, you know, yeah. Yes, y'all, that's this. <laughs> Can you imagine the flavor going on in this bowl? I really tried to do some more for y'all, but I really can't. I'll be full and uncomfortable. You guys could have this elote to go. Look at that. You came in and leaving with two tacos and two elotes. You guys do me a favor and share, share, share this video. Please share it out. It's my first time making these and I'm really excited about it. I appreciate you guys coming in. Happy Cinco de Mayo. Happy Taco Tuesday. So good. <laughs> mm. Mm. This just tops it off. <sighs> Y'all are the best for coming through. This is something else. Make sure you, if you are not yet subscribed to the channel, subscribe to the channel. Every Tuesday, your girl is going to work on a new recipe that she has never done before on tacos. I already have in mind the tacos for next week. I'm really excited about those. So, yeah. I, ha I had an appetite. See, for those of you who know me, and um, y'all know I fast. And my eating window is from 12 to 4. And then when you've been fasting for a while, I believe I'm going on two months now, your stomach goes, you can't eat five tacos no more, girl. Because I sure did think I was about to eat all five. <laughs> These are looking good. Extra chili. I'm not going to ruin it. I'm going to give it to my husband. He'll want it. He was like, because he had to go somewhere. He was like, I want some more when I get home. <laughs> Alright, y'all. I held you for a minute. How is everyone doing? How are you guys doing? <laughs> are you guys still staying inside? Stay inside. It's not time to go out and start getting into stuff yet, y'all. It's not time. No. It's way too soon. But with that being said, how is everyone doing? We're good. Everyone's well. Healthy. Um, everybody's well. Jojo's learning new words. He no, it's his favorite word. Jojo's both. <laughs> um, Ina's grown up beautifully. Everybody's doing well. You know, teenagers are teenagers. Uh, my daughter is learning how to French braid, so she's using Ina and his long, beautiful hair as a mannequin. I guess you will. A mannequin oh, excuse me I can't think of the word what it what they called yeah. a client not a client well I guess so I don't know there's a word it's gonna come up to me when I'm done recording what is it for I don't know <laughs> I love you guys. Please consider subscribing to the channel if you have not yet subscribed. And I will see you 
guys on Friday. I will see you guys on Friday. There's actually something really fun and um, coming up on Friday. It's in the making, stuff like that. Uh, so stay tuned till Friday for that. And I will see you guys then. Love you. Bye.